Hello everyone, it's Peter here, Pet Fistner. How are you doing guys? Hello. So today we've got the delivery. And this delivery should be from China. And this should be a thermal camera. Again, I'm not affiliated in any way. And all I did is I went on AliExpress and I was looking for for a higher resolution. So the resolution has to be about 150, 200 at least or more, but should cost less than 200 pounds. And and I couldn't, to be true. There was everything about 200, 250 pounds, like nothing cheap. But because I, I didn't have a pressure, I was, you know, having this small 8x8 pixels, pathetic one. And to be true, it's not needed. You can literally get a alcohol sprayed and you can see what is what is bubbling you or, or drying out quicker. And to be true, you don't need thermal camera that much. But because I've got apprentices and I, I try to sometimes show something, yes? Uh, then thermal imaging camera. I don't know if you can see 100, 256 on 192, yes? So that's what it is. Here is this. This, there's a camera, quite a bit of uh, equipment, yes. Um, you can see what it is, and there is a cable and a charger, USB charger, nothing else, no surprises, no surprises uh, at the bottom of it. So this is a USB charger. And that's 0.6 amp takes only, so that's 5 volts and 2 amps. 5 volts, 2 amps. And the cable, USB type C or micro, micro USB. It is what it is, but I think I knew it would be micro USB, to be true. Okay, so here is the charging port. Okay, don't know if it's charged or not charged. And here is the lens. Okay, press or press and hold. Neither nor is discharged, probably. Oh no, no, press and hold. Okay. So it's loading the software. Okay. So let me get a PCB. Okay. You know what? I'll show you closer. So it has central point set up and then it, it activates different ports. Ah, you can't see. I see that the webcam is bad. I think I need to re-record it on the higher, on the uh, DSLR. But it's not bad. It's not bad. I can I can see it's not bad. It's not greatest, but it's not bad. And there are select menu. So you got different modes. I don't know if you can see it don't know why this this is making us such trouble so the webcam is really bad they don't have a cable for dslr it's image registration images videos color palette so color palette that's a spectra that's iron that's iron 
Okay. Menu. Okay. Yes, I think. I think you you can choose here in the color palette. One, two, three, four, five. Five options. Spectra. That's the spectra. There is black and white as well. And some settings. Whatever the settings might be. Intensity, language, unit, temperature, range, time, format, set time, spot, and version. And auto shutdown. So it's, you know what? I can say to you from what I see here. It's registering components, but it, it's not micro. So in order to have something like micro picture, you need to have extra lens. For this one, you won't have probably any lens, so it's no way you can do it. And store photo, yes. Okay, so the button here is to st uh, take a photo and store a photo. The good thing is that I can see through components and these, but this is not still something guys i wouldn't i think if you can afford 100 pounds more i think you would need to consider different this is not as i thought it would be okay i will keep it of course because it's quite capable of but it's not as great as i would think it would be I can see components, I can see tiny bit components, but they are not as vivid as we would want them. At least I can use my pen here, it's better than that camera, because I can use my pen, for instance, and point to the place, take it, and I can see which place it is. So it is like in between, fully professional camera and in between, you know. Or can I take my silver? Okay, so I'm 33.6 degrees. Star photo, no. Yes. Yes, okay. Let's see how much it, it costs. Uh, and I will use it for some time and I will make probably use of it to be true press and hold will it turn off yes it will turn off power on off and let us switch to the picture here so i paid for it 165 17. i don't know if the price is great or not uh, that's the that's the stuff where i bought it the prices are jumping on and off, so that's that's just the basic price. Uh, it, the delivery was quite fast, actually. I can't say it was really, really long a time. Even now it's showing that estimated delivery is 21st to 23rd, and today it's 7th. So, you know, so it's really not long time to, to wait for it. And it should have... 256 on 192 resolution i don't know if that's true or not but looking like okay mm, here 256 and 192 and what i can say is there are some people not happy but there are always some people not happy there, there is no way i i invited camera yes so friends sorry it's the same product you see so I, I did check the reviews before buying actually this product and in general it was you know like if I see 17 um, positive then I am happy to, to purchase 
Then the second uh, stuff I'm doing is here. And if the seller is selling from 2020 and he've got, uh, you know, high, uh, high number as 4.8, 4 4.9, uh, I would say it's worth risking buying from the seller. Okay. So did I expect anything better? I don't know what I was expecting to be true. It's not for sure as bad as this one is. Second foremost, it's, uh, I don't know if this one comes with a software for the PC, because if this doesn't come, I can see that the one which I bought RX 500, there is RX 500 with a bug, 680 with PC software analysis. But again, is it connecting with, with the camera? I don't know. Yes, that's, that's what I need to find out. I'm okay if it doesn't because most of the time we're finding without thermal camera. Yes, so this is more of a show off than anything else. And the display is much bigger. You can compare these two. You can see how much bigger it is. So that's 1.8 or something that's over three inches. Three, no, 3.2. I don't see the screen here. Yeah, uh, display size two to 3.9 inches. Depend which model probably. But what I wanna say is for sure it's better than the one which we had. That's for sure. Uh, is it the last camera I bought? Probably not. That's RX 500, this one. And my question, yes, question to myself is if I'm, if I will be happy with it. Uh, you know when I would be happy with it? If this would connect to a PC and I could share the screen with you, then I would be really happy with it. If no, I will be still happy because I can see that the quality of the picture is not too bad. But would I buy it again if I would not do what I'm doing only, you know, that the, the work would be limited as it was before when we had just few jobs per week, I wouldn't buy this product. I'm telling you straight away, it's no way, okay, it's charging, yes. but it's probably that's all it does. Yes, the 500 model is probably the model which I don't believe that will be connected with your PC. And I didn't want to uh, overpay for them because I can do my job without them. So why would you know? Uh, yeah, and it's recognizing and it's showing images and videos. Yes, IR image tool as well there is one software another program is currently using this file okay so i don't think i can add to the obs studio video video capturing device okay yes there there is none there's none. So this is, this is not recognizable in the device manager and this is not recognizable uh, in the OBS studio. So why? What's wrong with this? I've got no idea, but there was this software and it's not anymore on the on the card here, on the storage. I don't know how big storage is as well. Menu, images, videos, color. I don't see anything about uh, connecting to the computer. So this is the cheaper version probably and that, that doesn't come with the... Okay, now USB is disconnected. Yes, when, when you plug in the device, it should show you in the device manager 
this is not showing in the device manager. I will try to learn more. You can see that the chip, I can see my nail and I can I can distinguish the difference, you know, not only fingers but as well nails, which is quite okay to be true, yes. So would I would I buy it again? I'm not sure. I need to use it. I need to use it to make a decision. For now, I'm 50-50. Uh, good that I bought it, I've got better understanding and when my technicians and apprentices will say you know like oh we should buy this or that I can then compare it and say look we could but maybe it's not worth so I I can read Sony on it on my amp I can I can recognize the item as well as the hi-fi amp it's it's not bad but I need to learn more about it and I need to definitely uh, then share with you our findings for now i would say don't buy it yes at the first attempt if you're going to buy it answer yourself some questions more what do you require and if you can spend 165 probably you can add more 100 pounds extra or something and get something uh, which will connect with your pc and then the capturing card will will take it um, if that's what you wish and that's what you need and second maybe you can get with even better resolution yes so I would say let's wait let's observe and I will be happy to share with you more about this camera soon yes thank you very much guys see you in the next one bye bye